bashing out a cup of tea before uh, I get myself away and finish packing up. I'm still amazed at how much this place is actually flooded. Going back I'm going to have to go through the trees or right up there because that side is cut off, I've checked already. It's not bad actually, it might I might be able to get up the side of the trees. So I'm almost packed up. Just having a coffee first. Got to take my tap down because it's still raining a bit. This uh, it's definitely an enjoyable camp. A lot of wildlife at night time. An owl was hooting almost all night, and I'm sure there was pigeons too, doing that old you know, the shit that they do that keep you awake all night. <laughs> Not that I'm bitter or that. I've got a good five hours, I'm happy. shake off before I take it down and put it in my bag. There's a lot of water on that. That's it done. I'm heading home now. That's where I had my fire pit last night. But not that it makes a difference in trying to hide this because the way the rain's gone it's all gonna be flooded soon anyways. So I'm out of here or to find a way out of this uh, little gully without getting too messy. Sweet. Well, I went hell for leather and I've got back to one of my camps. Only like in the six, six and a half miles to go. And I am home. Might pop in and check on my decoder fire, but see if it flooded or absorbed the water good last night because there's quite a lot of uh, water put down last night as you've seen by my tap this morning that river that river's on higher than it were a lot one I know it's, it's flooded down further down by the farmers fields that I've got across so that's like halfway up the trees down there that's a good meter. Ran from like uh, 12 pm to, well, about an hour ago. Quite heavy too. Right, I thought if I'm gonna fall in cow dirt, I want it on video. <laughs> As you can see, my beautiful decoder hole is still here, but it, unfortunately it won't be much longer because if you see from the first night I was out here to now, the water's risen by about three foot next to the actual bit where I hammer camped. Epic.
<laughs> that's amazing. That is three foot easy in one night. Totally epic. I'm going to stop for a cup of tea. I've got throffy coffee because my milk is totally uh, shook up. Oh, it's still good. That water is so close, it's just going to flood my uh, pit. I suppose once it goes down, I could uh, sort it out again. Every plank at camp I seem to pick floods. It's ridiculous. <laughs> From now on, it's total high up camps. <laughs> Lucky, lucky. Although if I did camp here last night, I still would have been okay. Because I was in a hammock and I'm a good, what, three, three foot from the water yet where my hammock is. So, 